Fox News' Tara Nash are here now with more on this historic night. Yes, tonight was a world debut of Ford's most popular truck, but electrified. The F-150 Lightning is a vehicle that was years in the making, and it did not disappoint. Welcome to the future. The unveiling of the smart and powerful Ford F-150 Lightning at the historic Rouge plant in Dearborn, expected to accelerate the move to electric vehicles. Bill Ford calling it a generational celebration. And that's what today is all about. Reinvention and improvement. Forward and upward. Technology, not for its own sake, but to make people's lives better. On behalf of the workers who build this new electric vehicle and our partners here this evening, we launch a new chapter of UAW Ford Innovations and Sustainability and Good Jobs. With a base price starting around $40,000, the sleek vehicle offers a 300 mile drive with an overnight charge, effortless torque, super intelligence with the latest in software, navigation and wireless technology. If you lose power at home, like the ice storms in Texas, the F-150 Lightning will power your house for day upon day upon day. And it's all seamless and controlled through your phone on the Ford Pass app. On Tuesday during his visit, President Joe Biden taking an impromptu ride in the electrified truck, commenting on its quick speed and sleek ride. He hopes the popular vehicle will help bolster his plan to phase out gas powered vehicles and move to clean energy. It's a truck that will usher in a cleaner future for our country and it will fulfill our promise to our children and our grandchildren that our generation is committed to leaving them a cleaner planet. Yes, we're all still amazed here about bringing power to your house for days upon days. Well, unfortunately, though, on the day of the official unveiling, Ford also announcing the automaker will have to cut production at eight plants because of the global chip shortage. And that piece of technology is very important when it comes to the auto industry going electric. Monica Huell. It's so exciting to see this oh, technology, yeah. but also to see the reality with this chip shortage well, as well. The president got a chance to drive it. Hopefully we'll get a chance to drive <laughs> one Let's too. Let's hope so. Yeah. It's fun to see what's coming. Yeah, absolutely.